limb lengthening operations are a growing trend in the field of cosmetic surgery. The procedure is generally viewed as a godsend for people whose short stature affects their lives and psychological well-being, as the operations can add a good 2 to 3 inches to their height, but they do come at a cost. Not only are they ridiculously expensive, but they also involve having your legs broken. The painful surgery was once reserved for people with dwarfism or children with uneven limb length. But now it seems that men and women with below average height are willing to brave the torment for purely cosmetic reasons. The arduous and prolonged procedure begins with a doctor breaking the patient's shin bones and inserting a telescopic rod into them. Over time, as the bones heal, the rod pulls the bones apart gradually, approximately 1 mm per day. As the bone is stretched, new bone, nerves, arteries, and skin grow to fill in the gap. The process is complete in about three months' time, adding two to three inches to overall height. After this, the patient would need several months of physiotherapy to recover completely. Dr. Draw Paley, an orthopedic surgeon from Florida, had performed about 650 leg lengthening surgeries by 2012. He said that most of his patients had dwarfism or severe deformities, while a few had height dysphoria and did not find psychotherapy helpful. They're unhappy with their height, he explained. It's one of those few psychologic psychiatric disorders that you can actually cure with the knife. Case in point is New Jersey resident Akash Shukla, who grew from 4 foot 11 to 5 foot 2 after undergoing the surgery. He described being under 5 foot tall as a void inside me, an emptiness in my heart. He also defended his decision to get surgery, there are people that have said, just accept what God gave you. But, in some way, shape or form everybody is trying to alter what God gave them. If God gave kids crooked teeth, they get braces.